friends i am rijo uh, today we are plan to discuss the topic microsoft into admx policy configuration so just we will go for our learning objective uh, what is a learning objective we will discuss introduction of admx policy and admx policy limitation and demo of admx policy creation so let's we will discuss for the admx policy so what is admx policy means import the custom or third party administrative template uh, files into the into an environment so the previous video we discussed uh, the device profile creation how to we can implement the a uh, policy but that policy is already built in policy from the microsoft into so if you have third party application you need to implement the third party application policy so how to we can upload in the third party administrative template you can use the admx files so each admx file have support the language html only one html language will be support for the each admx file so what is the limitation maximum 20 admx file can be uploaded each file must be 1 mb or smaller and each admx file only one admx file can be uploaded so admx file have dependency pre request so what is a dependency pre request means uh, if example you need to upload one mozilla firefox okay but the firefox will be depends from the mozilla so if you not upload the mozilla then fire the firefox will not work they will give the error for this is the pre requesting file is not found okay so now we will uh, create for the admx in the lab so what we are doing for there we will uh, the third party application zoom we will upload the zoom admx file in the intune portal okay so let's we will go for our uh, microsoft intune portal then we will check how to we can upload the zoom admx file so now we reach our uh, intune portal so just go for the platform windows so here you can just go for the manage device configuration so here you can see the import admx so just go for import admx so we can import here just click you can import the admx file here you can see here one admx file and one admx file for the default language only one language default language will be support for the microsoft intune admx file upload uh, we need to check for our zoom account for how to we can upload the admx file you just go for the search in the google uh, admx for zoom just admx profile for the zoom just mass deployment group policy objects just click like this one so here you can see uh, pre requesting configuration gpu available template this is the admx policy file you just go for the policy version just click it so now the zoom application admx file is downloaded just open it then extract all then zoom 6 point so now you can see here this is the admx and adml this sklm means device level device management cu means user management okay so here is you can go for the language adml file okay so what we will do we need to upload this admx file in the intune portal so how to we can do this one just we will go for again our intune portal and we just click import admx then we just go for click import then you can go for create the admx file and admx file for the default tag just to go for click then go for download before download zoom 6.0 so here you can see sklm and cu i just go for the user level just open then here adml file for language file just click that one you can see here adml language cu open so now we just click next then create so successfully uploaded we are waiting for the upload in progress if you have any error it will be coming status will be error so just waiting for the upload completion okay. so now we just try to refresh again now you can see here our upload is fail so what is the reason we need to check we just click the upload fail 
so here you can see the upload uh, the admx file half failed to continue you will need to delete the upload and address to the action to the error details again so what is the error details we admx file reference not found in the namespace missing so previously we discuss uh, for the dependency so i think this file need the dependency we need to upload the dependency so how to we can check the dependency what dependency we need to upload so just we will go for the previously download folder then zoom open then we can go for the admx then open with the notepad then here control find yeah here you can see policy namespace policy namespace dependency so here you can see here microsoft policy windows namespace is needed to upload so using prefix windows and namespace microsoft dot policy dot windows needed to upload so how to we can get the Microsoft dot policy dot Windows. So if you not available, first we can go for download it. So now we need to just download the administrative. Just to go for here. Uh, you can so administrative template ADMX Windows 10 number will be available. Then after that you just go for download. It automatically download. So previously I am already downloaded. So I just again no need to go for downloaded. So I just give this link in the below description also upload the in Dune again so we just go for uh, we need to delete this one we need to again upload so just we need to delete the previous upload zoom admx file after that what we will do we just go for the import our admx file windows just file so just go for click here then after that you just go for after you installation for here program file 86 then my my group policy then you can see windows number then policy definition click then here you can search windows windows admx just open it after that adml file for the default language just go for here we need it which adml file you need just upload it english windows in adml yeah just upload it windows adml so after your windows admx and after that windows adml you upload then click next then create so now we will upload our dependency windows admx file it take little bit time to uploading refresh again so now the windows admx file we will upload already so now we need to upload the our zoom again just to go for zoom we previously download just to go for the download then zoom then we need to open after that we need to upload the ADML file so now we will upload the zoom then we need to just create so we upload the dependency for windows and we just upload the zoom it and we need to check any error will be coming or no okay so just waiting for the upload completion so now we need to refresh the zoom implement is complete or no see now the zoom uh, admx file is uploaded completed so before you can see the error will come now the error will be going because we already upload the dependency so what with the next we just so now we need to plan to create the policy for the zoom so how to we can do this one so just we will uh, go for the same windows by platform windows then we just go for the configuration then we need to create the new policy then we need to select the windows 10 letter so here template so here you can go for administrator template preview see imported administrator template preview. just to click this one then create so after that you need to enter zoom yeah zoom account policy just anything type then description also same because testing purpose we just ended then we just go for so here you can see you were not because we implement user con just click the user configuration you can see here zoom meeting is coming so here you can chat setting zoom general settings and zoom meeting default zoom meeting setting and zoom update setting you can set auto update for the schedule just to click this one so enable it set the specific update channel when the auto update feature is enabled you can click if you need then click this one so demo purpose i just go for next then you just go for next 
then assign and currently i will not assign anything just go for review then create so just to refresh see zoom account policy we administrate a template we implement for the using the admx profile so now you understand how to we can import the admx uh, policy profile then how to we can apply that policy in our intune portal so now i wind up my topic if you like my video please subscribe my channel and support me thank you so much